Imagine biting into a warm, crispy ball of meat ragu, coated in breadcrumbs and deep-fried to perfection. Welcome to the world of Dutch cuisine, a world where flavors are bold, textures are diverse, and influences span from Indonesia to France. This appetizing world is where the famous Dutch bitterball and a mouth-watering meatball was born. Dutch cuisine is a delightful mix of hearty, comforting, and downright delicious. Ready to embark on a culinary journey through the Netherlands? Let's start our countdown with number 10. At number 10, we have the irresistible Stroopwafels. Originating from Gouda in the Netherlands in the late 18th century, these sweet delights are a beloved staple of Dutch cuisine. Picture two thin, crispy waffles, their edges perfectly toasted to a golden hue. Sandwiched between these waffles is a heart of sweet and sticky syrup, caramelized to perfection. When you take a bite, the flavors meld together in an exquisite fusion. The gentle crunch of the waffle yielding to the rich, gooey caramel syrup. Stroop waffles are made by first baking the waffle batter in a special waffle iron. The baked waffle is then sliced in half and filled with the warm syrup. These treats are so popular they're not just a dessert, they're a snack, a breakfast item, even a coffee companion. With their blend of simplicity, sweetness, and crunch, Stroop waffles have indeed carved a sweet spot in the hearts of food lovers worldwide. From sweet treats, let's move on to number 9, a savory favorite. Coming in at number 9 is Ertenswip, a hearty Dutch pea soup. This soup is a delightful blend of split peas, celery, leeks, onions, and carrots. The ingredients are simmered together for hours, resulting in a thick, creamy soup that's as rich and comforting as a warm blanket on a chilly day. But Ertensuip is more than just its base. The soup often features chunks of pork and rookwurst, a Dutch smoked sausage, adding a smoky depth of flavor that contrasts beautifully with the earthiness of the vegetables. This combination of flavors has earned Ertensuip its status as a beloved winter comfort food in the Netherlands. It's often served with a slice of hearty rye bread, perfect for dipping and soaking up every last drop of this delectable soup. Ertensoep is a true example of how simple ingredients can come together to create something truly comforting and satisfying. From a comforting soup, we head to a dish that's a little more adventurous. At number 8, we dive into Dutch seafood with herring. A raw herring fish, herring is a true Dutch delicacy that's typically served with a simple yet tangy combination of onions and pickles, a pairing that enhances its unique briny flavor. This isn't any ordinary fish dish though. Herring is traditionally eaten by lifting the fish by the tail, tilting your head back and taking a bite. A little unconventional perhaps, but it's all part of the fun. Now what makes herring even more special is its cultural significance. Every year the Dutch celebrate the Herring Festival marking the start of the new herring season. It's a time when communities come together to enjoy this seafood treat, often accompanied by a glass of Dutch gin, known as Jennifer a true testament to the Netherlands' rich maritime history and love for simple, fresh ingredients. From the sea, we move on to a Dutch snack that's loved worldwide. At number 7, we have the worldwide favorite, Dutch fries. These aren't your average fries. Dutch fries are known for their distinctive thickness, creating an irresistible blend of fluffy interiors and crisp exteriors. But what truly sets them apart is the way they're served. In the Netherlands, these fries become a canvas for a variety of toppings, from traditional mayonnaise to the adventurous peanut sauce, and even a mixture of onions and curry ketchup, known as special. And let's not forget the cheese, a staple in Dutch cuisine often generously sprinkled over these golden sticks of deliciousness. These fries are not just a side dish, they're a main event in Dutch street food culture, a ubiquitous comfort food found at every corner, from bustling city centers to quiet country roads. The Dutch passion for these fries is so infectious, it has turned them into a global phenomenon. From a beloved snack, we now turn to a traditional Dutch breakfast. At number 6 we have Hagelslag, a delightful Dutch breakfast. This delightful treat is more than just your average breakfast food, it's a tradition, a comfort, a sweet way to start the day. Hagelslag, for those uninitiated, are chocolate sprinkles typically served over buttered bread. Yes, you heard it right, chocolate for breakfast. But don't let the simplicity fool you. These are not your ordinary sprinkles. The Dutch take their Hagelslag seriously. Made from real chocolate, they melt into the bread, creating a delightful gooey treat that's loved by children and adults alike. And the fun doesn't stop at chocolate, there are variations aplenty. From fruit-flavored Hagelslag to those made with dark or white chocolate, there's a flavor for every palate. Even the bread gets a look in with everything from whole grain to white being used as the base. 
Hegel Slag is more than just food, it's a celebration of the simple joys of life. From a sweet start to the day, let's move to a savory, lunchtime favorite. Coming in at number 5 is the savory Bruja Crockett. A cornerstone of Dutch cuisine, the Bruge Crockett is a lunchtime classic that has captured the hearts, or rather stomachs, of locals and tourists alike. Imagine a bread roll, crisp on the outside but soft within, cradling a croquet, a cylinder of deep-fried goodness. The crocket itself is a marvel, a crunchy shell encasing a creamy ragu of meat, usually beef or veal. The contrasts in texture, the crunch of the crocket against the softness of the bread, the creaminess of the ragu against the crisp exterior, make every bite an experience. And while the traditional Bruja crocket is a delight in itself, there are a plethora of variations to enjoy. Some folks prefer it with a dollop of mustard for that extra tang, others with a side of fries because, well, who can resist Dutch fries? From a hearty lunch, we turn to a classic Dutch dinner dish. At number 4, we have the hearty and comforting Stampot. This dish is a traditional Dutch favorite, a warming blend of mashed potatoes mingled with a variety of vegetables. Stampot is a versatile recipe, allowing for a delightful mix of flavors, from the sweetness of carrots to the earthy taste of kale, and even the subtle bitterness of endive. But let's not forget the crowning glory of Stampot, the Rookwurst. This smoked sausage adds a robust, smoky flavor that beautifully complements the creamy mashed potatoes and vegetables. Stampot isn't just a meal, it's a hug in a bowl, the epitome of Dutch comfort food. With its numerous variations, from the classic boar and cool stampot made with kale to a more modern version featuring Brussels sprouts, there is a stampot for every palate. It's a dish that's deeply rooted in Dutch culture, an emblem of homey, hearty, and wholesome cooking. From a filling dinner, we move to a Dutch pastry that's a holiday favorite. At number three, we have the festive Olibullen. Picture this, a deep-fried sweet dumpling, often filled with plump raisins and generously dusted with powdered sugar. This, my friends, is the iconic Olibullen, a Dutch culinary delight that is as fun to say as it is to eat. Olibullen, literally translated as oil balls, are a staple in Dutch holiday celebrations, particularly on New Year's Eve. It's said that the tradition of eating these scrumptious dumplings dates back centuries to a time when they were eaten to ward off evil spirits. Today, oliebelen are a symbol of celebration and are a must-have at any Dutch fair or festival. Their sweet, doughy goodness combined with a crispy, golden-brown exterior creates a taste sensation that is both comforting and indulgent. They're the perfect companion to a cup of hot chocolate or mulled wine, making the chilly Dutch winter a little bit warmer and a lot more delicious. From a festive treat, let's move to the number two spot. Coming in at number two is hachi, a traditional Dutch stew. This hearty dish has been warming the hearts and stomachs of the Dutch since the medieval times. Its simplicity is its strength, as it mainly consists of three key ingredients, succulent beef, aromatic onions, and a thick, rich gravy that ties everything together. The beef is slow cooked to perfection, melting in your mouth with every bite, while the onions add a sweet and tangy flavor that is truly unique. But it's the gravy, thickened with a roux of butter and flour, that gives hachi its signature richness. This comforting stew is often served with potatoes or rice, making it a complete meal that promises satisfaction. Its deep, robust flavors are a testament to the Dutch tradition of creating dishes that are both simple and deeply satisfying. With its rich history and comforting qualities, hachi truly embodies the spirit of Dutch cuisine. And now, we've reached our number one spot. And at number one, we have the king of Dutch snacks, Bitterballen. Bitterballen, a culinary gem from the heart of the Netherlands, reigns supreme in the world of Dutch snacks. This delightful treat is a true testament to the Dutch love for flavor and texture harmony. At first glance, it may look like just another fried ball, but wait until you take a bite. The exterior is a golden brown crispy shell that crackles delightfully with every bite. But that's just the beginning. Inside, it's a whole different story. A creamy, rich meat ragu awaits you, contrasting perfectly with the crispy shell. The ragu is a savory blend of beef or veal, thickened with roux and enriched with a hearty stock. It's like biting into a little ball of heaven, a burst of flavors that dances on your tongue. Bitterballen has earned its status as the go-to snack for Dutch locals at bars and parties. It's almost a ritual to have these crispy balls served alongside a good Dutch beer. The chilled beer and the warm bitterballen create a match made in culinary heaven, a pairing that brings people together and ignites conversations. So there you have it, our top 10 countdown of the best Dutch foods. 
Each one offers a unique taste of the Netherlands, so why not give them a try?